Hey what up guys, today we'll be looking at some full nut hash and how well it functions out of the Atmos raw vaporizer. Um, it's just a little vaporizer pen. This is the battery. It comes with the ceramic heating element which I've used the hell out of. And this is the mouthpiece. Get this out. This basically is this rubber mouthpiece. It has like this uh, ceramic filter inside and also has this little and it has a little spring. So basically it's a spring, a little screen. It's right there. The ceramic filter with the mouthpiece. So that's that. It just goes on like that. It's actually really nice. I mean, it feels like it's pretty good quality. It's like it has a rubber coating. Quality-wise, it feels really nice. All right, and then it just comes with you know the instructions, charger, extra springs. The USB attachment to the charger. So you could either plug it in like this and charge it in the wall, <coughs> or you can, uh, you know, plug it into your uh, PC or your uh, car USB. All right, and then it comes with. Uh, Little clean brush. So just to clean this out like this. <clears throat> and also comes with this uh, poker and I guess uh, packer. I guess this is for packing it. Now the heating element is actually this little like. Uh, See, that thing right there, see how it heats up? Yeah, that's the heating element right there. Alright, so basically what you do... Um, so you just get the full melt, like I have right here. Put it in there. That's it. Now I'm just going to show you guys how good it works for an uh, example. Wow, the full melt's in there. There's the button. Alright. Just see. It already starts smoking it up. Look at that. Look at that. All that smoke coming out. I feel bad because I wasted that, but <laughs> the purpose of this video is to show you guys that you know you'll be able to go ahead and smoke your fuma while you're traveling now. And this pen looks really nice, actually. <coughs> As you can see. The only thing I don't like about it is the button. After a while, this button will get loose. So, Atmos, if you're watching, yeah, you see how my button got loose? Hopefully you guys could uh, do something to fix that. Actually, what I did was, <clears throat> instead of holding it here and opening it, I held it from right here. And when I twisted it open, see, it went like that. And kind of moved the rubber. So that's kind of a flaw in this piece. But anyways. Go ahead and uh, smoke it to show you guys. Alright, so let's try it out now. Wow. 
<coughs> Here's one more thing I wanted to show you guys with this pan. Um, this is just my bong right here, my Sheldon. It's actually just a 45 millimeter adapter with a 14 millimeter uh, female end. And what you do, you just put it the opposite way, which kind of makes it straight. And you get the atmosphere which fits in perfectly, like right here. All right, now watch this. And let me, let me get everything in there. Watch, guys. <clears throat> so you guys know I am bullshitting on how good this uh, pen works with full melts. Now, when I say it works good, I'm saying it works good with full melts. Dude, that shit was so good. Let's do it again. <coughs> so yeah, that actually worked really, really good, guys. Highly recommend it, using it like this. Um, yeah, so that was just something I wanted to show you guys. So there you have it guys, as you can see, for a full melt, <coughs> this is really, really good. Highly recommend using full melt with this. You could also use it for weed, but it ain't as good for the weed as it is for the full melt. Um, I wouldn't use it with no oils, it just doesn't work. Yeah guys, so there it is, uh, the Atmos Raw. Like I said, I highly recommend it for a uh, full melt. That's about what I recommend it for. That's basically it. So if you want, if you're like a full melt head, or like a hash head, bubble hash head or whatever, you're really gonna want this pen for your full melts. All right, peace.